Well, we follow this now with the Young Kennel Club Stakes final and presentation. We have seven dogs and handlers who will come into the ring. The Young Kennel Club is a splendid organization. It's open to youngsters from the age of six up to 24. And they take part in competitions up and down the country and winning a championship show gives them the opportunity to come to Crufts and take part in the semi-finals, which have already been judged today. And we're going to see the winners of each group just in the same way as we see the best in show competition for the main breeds of dog and uh, for the adult competition, or rather for the, the main competition for best in show, the Young Kennel Club Stakes has its own best in show. And you'll see them all, one from each of the seven groups coming into the ring in just a moment. Our judge for this is a former chairman of the Kennel Club. He'll be coming into the ring in just a moment, uh, Mr. Ronnie Irving. Always a pleasure to see him. Joel King, chairman of the Crufts Committee, introducing former chairman of the Kennel Club to judge this. Ronnie Irving, a wonderful border terrier breeder himself, is uh, now taking a look at the first entry that's coming in. This is the Lakeland Terrier. Interesting, this in the Terrier group that we have a Lakeland coming in because in Best in Show later today, you'll see another Lakeland, which has won through in the group there. In the Hound group, we have the Whippet. In the Utility group, we had the Dalmatian. And here in the Toy group, we have the Bichon Frise. The Pointer wins the Gundog group. The Bouvier de Flandre comes in as the winner of the Working group. And here, the Bearded Collie, the winner of the Pastoral Group. Those are the seven contenders, seven beautiful dogs brought here by these youngsters who take part in various competitions of all sorts. The Young Kennel Club, a tremendous organization. Anyone interested, any child getting used to and enjoying dogs, a wonderful organization to be part of. So Ronnie Irving taking a long look, well, a gentle look along the line, getting a first view of these dogs being presented beautifully by their young handlers. So Ronnie Irving, who's uh, already judged them in the semi-finals to bring them through to this position, and now is moving the dog so you can see. The handler here is Catherine Broaders. She's 16, she comes from County Wexford in Ireland. And the dog's called Brookside Aristocrat, and they qualified for the Kennel Club, uh, Young Kennel Club Stakes at the Belfast Championship Show, which is one of the criteria. You have to win a championship show, uh, and therefore, for the semi-finals, if you win it, as this one has, you come into the miniature best in show competition. The Terrier Group winner, the Lakeland Terrier. Nice movement from the Lakeland there. The Hound Group was won by the Whippet. Hannah Wayman is 17, she comes from Gloucester. Spamalt Northern Star is the Whippet's kennel name, known as Spotty. It was a birthday present, came all the way from Inverness to join them in Gloucester. Hannah says he's a bit of a character, loves to jump into your arms. I don't know if he's going to do that now. He's three years old, lives with his brother, his dad and his granddad. The Whippet, winner of the Hound Group. The Dalmatian won the utility group for Charlotte Louise Page, 23, from Ely in Cambridgeshire. Charlotte was the winner of this competition last year, and that gave her the qualification into the event this year with this same dog. Dalmatian, champion Windflash, born to be free. Charlotte and her dog climbed Ben Nevis together and trained for the young London Marathon. They have success both in the ring and out. Dalmatian with that wonderful striding movement, known, of course, as the carriage dog. And here, the winner of the toy group, the Bichon Frise, champion Fri Fribonche, catwalk queen, Daniel Taylor, 
who's 21, comes from Swansea. Daniel and Marnie have been showing together for three years. And Daniel, Danielle has been showing Bichon Frise since she was eight years old. She's made up two champions herself. Proud moment now. The Bichon Frise. And now we have the winner of the gun dog group. This fine striding, lovely movement from the pointer. Show champion and Irish champion Mulu Mills Minstrel, Minstrel at Hockwood. It's a junior warrant holder. Connie Rose Hazeltine, 20 year old owner from Dorking in Surrey. And Mork and she have been showing together for the last four and a half years. And uh, Connie says he's done me and the breed proud. Always performing and showing his socks off at every task. Here's the Bouvier de Flandre, the winner of the working group. Hayley Jones is 22, she comes from Chesterfield. This is a United Kingdom and Irish champion. Nicola Odsney. Hayley says she's been in dogs all her life. Has been best in show with two other Bouviers previous to today. Last but not least, we have the pastoral group winner. This is the Bearded Collie. Champion Carboni Calico star of Pellegrew. Connor Barclays is 15, comes from Hatfield in Hertfordshire. And Connie is the most, says that Collie is the most perfect pet with a fantastic personality. Just 15 is Connor. The dog is five years old. So that's our five champions which have come into the ring to take part in this best in show for the young kennel club stakes the boards are out we're just having a first and a reserve ronnie irving taking another long look along the line very experienced judge as i've said former chairman of the kennel club now where's he going to go well he's gone to the dalmatian would you believe this is uh, <laughs> this is Charlotte, who's uh, won it last year, she's won it again. My word, that Dalmatian has shown beautifully for her. And the bearded collie for the 15-year-old there at the end, coming through for Connor. <laughs> oh, my word. So a Dalmatian and a bearded collie, but it's the Dalmatian that takes the championship. Congratulations to them both. Uh, I must say, Charlotte has been working her socks off here at Crofts because she's been our assistant in the commentary boxes. She's been assisting the agility and flyball commentators all the time. She's been working like mad, still has time to present her dog beautifully. And here they come through with a second win on the run. The second time that Charles has won the Young Kennel Club Stakes. Brilliant for them. And of course, the prize, the award being made there. This is a splendid moment for Charlotte. Very proud moment for Charlotte. I'm delighted for her. She's been of such help to all of the commentators during the course of the four days of the show here. And there, Connor Bartlett from Hatfield in Hertfordshire with his bearded collie, his five-year-old bearded collie. What a moment for him, just 15 years old, and he gets the reserve in the Young Kennel Club Stakes. What a superb competition. Beautiful dogs, beautifully presented by young people who've come through the ranks of the Young Kennel Club from the age of perhaps six. Marvellous organisation, marvellous competition, splendid winner. Congratulations, Charlotte.